three Russian navigation satellites crashed into the Pacific off of Hawaii Sunday, December 5 after the rocket carrying them failed to reach orbit, officials from the Russian space agency said. The capsule carrying the three GLONASS satellites plummeted into the sea 900 miles off Honolulu. There have been no casualties. The failure is a setback for Russia's attempt to put a satellite navigation system in place to rival the United States' GPS you know, the Global Positioning System, and steal a march on Europe's fledgling Galileo system. Prime Minister Vladimir Putin has underscored the strategic significance of developing the GLONASS system to ensure Russia's technological independence. According to preliminary data, the Proton rocket took a wrong trajectory. Consequently, the booster rocket could not put the satellites in the intended orbit and it fell back with them into the atmosphere. Once separated from the Proton rocket, a second stage booster rocket, with the three satellites aboard should have put them in orbit about 12 miles above the Earth. The ballistics experts have checked everything, the upper stage rocket with the satellites is not on the main, intermediate nor emergency orbit. Putin said in April that Russia planned to equip all new cars sold in Russia in 2012 with the new navigation system. The Russian space agency said in 2008 that Venezuela and Cuba were interested in adopting the new system. Russia's defense ministry confirmed the loss, but insisted Sunday's accident would not affect the rollout of the new GPS system.